going along your life and something happens and your brain just like switches over and you're like, oh, I might need to escape from this situation. People yeah. who have female bodies and who have experienced layers upon layers upon layers of microaggressions to yep. assault, to abuse, to like, you know, coercion, yep. like they just, like men just do not have... Yep. You know, the majority of them don't have the same life experience and like lens yeah. through which they look at things. I don't move through the world just willingly smiling at everyone, being automatically open. I I have walls up that have been erected because of a necessity because yeah. I am in this body and I've had to deflect so many fucking advances, so much seedy, creepy crap, so much like unacceptable behavior, so much boundary crossing. It's just like another sort of microaggression that reaffirms mm -hmm. your place in society as men want it to be. The thing that men are most afraid of is that women will laugh at them. And then the thing that women are most afraid of is that men will kill them. And when this all went down, it was kind of like really just drove that quote home of like, here's this joke yeah. that's like funny for this guy or like his two loser friends. And for me, I'm like, oh, cool, I might die. And even though that's like a very small thought in the back of my head behind, you know, me thinking about the party, there's this little tiny voice in my head that's like, mm -hmm. yeah, you actually might be unsafe in the world.